If your back is feeling bad, okay, that's not funny. Okay, if your back is feeling bad and you've tried some things and they haven't been working, maybe you should try some Reiki. Bring in Jan Benson. Let's talk to her. Hello, Jan. How are you? I'm excellent. You're, you're a Reiki master in training. Yes, I am. What does that mean? That means I have my first degree Reiki. I have my second degree Reiki. Is it a Reiki. belt? I wish. Yeah. Uh, no, it's a, the first degree is a series of four attunements that you take classes for. Second degree is the same thing you take classes for. Master in training is a little more involved. Okay, tell, t tell me what more, more, how more involved. A lot more money. Are you, are, for you to spend or for you to make? For me to spend both. Okay. It's a, it's a dual, dual process. Uh -huh. It allows me to be able to teach Reiki to other people in the future. Can you teach Reiki to anybody or do you have to have uh, the shining, the shining or no, something? I don't know. You can actually teach it to anybody. In fact, I brought you an invitation to a class because what are you doing sitting behind this desk when your back hurts and you don't have Reiki? Oh my gosh, you know, you know that, <laughs> people are always like, check, right as soon as you go to commercial, you just jump up. It's because, you know, I, I, my lower yeah. back sometimes doesn't feel so great yeah. in these chairs and, I, and moving around does. Could you I, teach me how to Reiki a little bit right here? I can't teach you, I can Reiki you. <laughs> All there. Okay, so you can Reiki me right here? Yes. Okay. Go, can you do it while you're talking? Yes. Here, let me do it this way. Okay. The idea is to be comfortable when you're giving a treatment. Okay. Because if I'm not comfortable, it's going to transmit to you and you're not going to be comfortable. So since you're touching my wrist, are you Reikiing my wrist or are you Reikiing my whole body? Your whole body. body. It goes through your whole body. I've given Reiki in some of the weirdest, bizarre places ever. I just went to see um, Book of Mormon with a friend of mine. Oh, how, how was it? Did you, did you like it? Absolutely was loved it. Was it fun? Yeah, absolutely loved it. But she had hurt her knee, and so we're sitting in the audience, and I have one arm around her shoulder and one arm on her other shoulder, and for the first half of the play, she got a Reiki treatment. Wow. And, and a lot of laughs, I bet. Oh, yes. Yeah? Yes. I, I, heard, I heard it was great, and I'm so sorry was, that I missed it. Oh, I wanted to see it. It was excellent, and she left the theater feeling better. Awesome. Well, the, the yes. laughing couldn't hurt either, right? No, but the swelling in her knee went down. Awesome. T tell, tell me how you got into this. Um, were, you my mom, were you always a hippie? Well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. My mom was in the hospital, and every day I'd go in, and she was hooked up to another machine, and the doctor said, man, you're not going to make it. So my mom said, call Bobby Rocka Smith. She's a Reiki master. And I thought, hey, well, you know, we've tried weird things before. Why not? Mm -hmm. Within a week of Bobby going into treating my mom, she turned around. And she is alive and healthy and living in Santa Cruz today, 83, almost 84 years old. Excellent. Great, great for her. And is she still getting Reiki? In fact, I just came back. She sprained her neck last week doing too much gardening. <clears throat> yeah. In uh, Santa Cruz? <laughs> in Santa Cruz. I got gotcha. you. So we went over, my daughter and I, and she sat on the couch, and I gave her treatments, and we watched TV and had a good time. Uh, not so long ago, in the middle of the night, I, I did an <laughs> awkward stretch, and it took my breath away. My lower back was out. Uh, Kim tried to help me out of bed. She, and she said, lift me up. And I said, don't lift me up. And I said, get my legs. And I said, don't touch my legs. And, I, and I'm screaming and crying. That was the day she did the show for me. I uh, actually crawled against the wall uh -huh. to get from the bedroom to the living room just so I could watch the show. Grabbed a couple beers and a bottle of brandy on the way. <laughs> and this is at 9 o'clock in the morning. It felt like the good old days. So I... Uh, I, I was in a hell of a lot of pain. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you, you messaged me and said uh, I'll be over this afternoon. I would have tried anything. Yeah. I mean, it, yeah. it, it was. It's one of those ones where I was crying. It, 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 yeah. it hurt. You laid me down, put your hands on my back, and did not not a lot, much more than what you're doing right now, yeah. Timmy. About 45 minutes, you were there. Yeah, about that. And when you left, I uh, got up and walked out to the living room and sat down, uh, pretty amazed. That, <laughs> you know, I was expecting some, t some type of massage or something, which I, I, I was terrified well, that's what screamed. it was going to be. But, I, <laughs> but if it was going to help, I was going to do yeah. it. And uh, pretty, pretty darn amazing. It is. And is it up here? It's everywhere. 
the thing that it is, is that when you go to a class and you get the attunements, it affects every part of your being. It would improve your show. No, don't leave. <laughs> <laughs> it improves body, spirit, mind, the whole thing, whatever. I mean, it's not going to do things that aren't in the plan. You know, it won't stop somebody from dying if that's their plan. But I've been with people on the way out, and it eases the way out, makes it a lot easier. I know you've had some family medical issues that Reiki's been sent to and things have turned out pretty darn okay. Mm -hmm. um, I had one client that got stabbed from the pelvic bone up to the rib cage. Just stabbed? Yeah, in, in Vegas and my daughter called and said, Mom! So we did a road trip and um, he was out of the hospital within a week. Wow. Um, what do you mean you can send Reiki? You can send it. You I, can do it with the, from far away? If you're second degree, yes. You can do it if you're first degree, but it's more powerful if you're second degree. So, yeah, I send Reiki all the time. I have a little box at home that I put down names and situations and put it in the little box, and every night I, mean, I sit there with my little box. You Reiki the box? And I Reiki the box, and... It's funny, when I'm doing that, a lot of times other people will come in and say, send me, send me, send me. <laughs> so you just add them to the list. Every once in a while, I clear out the box. and. So I'm going to take this right here and <laughs> grab this piece of paper that I dropped when I got all, all excited. Go ahead and go back to Reiki me. Yes. Uh, Reiki first, de first degree class. Uh, give yourself the gift of self-healing so you can Reiki yourself. Right here, right now. Because I'm a little nervous. <laughs> you can Reiki yourself. Yes. Wow. Uh, taught by Bobby Rocka Smith, the same person that saved your mom. Yes. Okay. Have the full power of the universe in your hands. Come share a weekend that can change your life. Where's this? Where's this located? Uh, we do treat. Uh, we do um, classes at her house right now. Okay. So you you go there for the it's weekend. It's local. Well, no, you go there for a couple hours. I see. And go home and come back and you know. And she can work around schedules, because what it is, first degree is, is for attunements. And they have to be given within 12 hours of each other, but not sooner than four hours. So she's doing one on, th she gives you one attunement Thursday night, one on Friday night, one on Saturday, and one on Sunday. And on Saturday and Sunday is the meat of the class when you go and actually give treatments to other people. And she comes by and tells you, lower your shoulders, they're too high. You know, be comfortable, be centered, because you don't want to be, you know. Right, well, you want you the want other to be, person to be relaxed. Right, exactly. Too. And she teaches you how to do all of this. And it's phenomenal. We have the best time. Is there a cost? The cost of first degree is 250 and most people go, oh, that's a lot. But if you figure how much you spend on medicine mm -hmm. and insurance, and all of the things to do to be healthy, that's cheap. Mm -hmm. And the more that you lasts do it, forever. the more you do it, the more powerful you get. Oh, really? You can be a first degree Reiki person and be more powerful than a Reiki master if you do it a lot. I know a lady that has first degree, and oh my God, I'll take a treatment from her any day because she is that powerful. She has done it that much. Uh, August 20th, 21st, 22nd, and 23rd, give yourself the gift of self-healing Reiki first degree class taught by Bobby Rocker Smith. I'm sure you'll be there. You betcha. Mm -hmm. And if, there, if someone wants a Reiki treatment from you? Give me a call or give me an email. What's the, what's the number? 392-8352. Um, the email is reikijan at gmail.com. And that's R-E-I-K-I. -I. Yes. And if you get um, Reiki, the first degree, you can come to the Reiki retreat in October from October 2nd to October 4th at a ranch down in Visalia. And it's a whole weekend of Reiki. How fun. It is. Jan Benson, always, always, always Thank good you, to darling. see you. Okay, we're going to take a quick commercial break. We'll be right back.